All right, so good uh, afternoon to my YouTube friends and basket makers. I just had one to come out today and show you three different more concepts that you can do. Um, the first one I had wanted to show you, uh, this is another one I had revamped out and did over. Uh, this one here is a cute uh, thinking of you basket. So I made this one up and I put the cute prayer card on the front of here. Um, it's coming from Timothy 2, 1 and 7 says, For God has not given us a spirit of fear and timid it a power love and self-discipline so this is a cute um cute little cheer up basket here it's called a thinking of you basket i had made this one up cute thinking of you basket so this is one that i did up i revamped it out and did that one up so that's a one concept that you can use with the um the gift boxes i got the gift boxes from dollar general and this is how cute it is i got the epsom salt a nice bath frizzer, a nice body sponge, and a nice cute candle inside of there. And then I put the nice cute prayer card on the front of them. Okay. This one here is another thinking of you basket. I did this cute one with a wooden spoon. I put a nice um, glove inside of here, the dish glove. Some nice apple cranberry tea. And then I put the nice cute um, dish mat on here a little cloth yeah and I put another cute little prayer cloth so these are my thinking of you gifts so these are two of them here that I did up so that's one concept that's another concept here with the gift boxes that I got from um, Hobby Lobby you can use those and I took a little bit of twine the brown jute and placed on there and took a little cute bow and put on there a cello wrap this one so this is a cello wrap one and then that's the shrink wrap one here. So those are two thinking of you baskets. And then I did up also a cheer you up basket. So somebody just want a nice cute gift. What I did is I revamped it. This one was in the silver bucket. I revamped it out and placed it into this one. Let me know down below in the comments how you all like these. So these are three different concepts here. These little small containers. They like little cute tubs. You can get those from um, the Dollar General. I got those from there. And this is a cute one here. So this is another one here that you can use. You can use a basket. You need to use a cute little mini gift boxes uh, that they have at Dollar General. Or you can use a smaller white container gift boxes from Dollar General. These are three different concepts that you can use. Um, yeah, they're going to come in handy. Like I said, I did two thinking of you gifts and one is a cheer up gift. So that's the name of those gifts there. But I just wanted to come out today and show you guys those three different concepts. Um, you can do them in different ones. Like I said, these are three here that um, are very nice. Um, yeah, this is a nice one here. Like I said, that's a thinking of you gift. And then this is another thinking of you gift. So these are different concepts that you can come up with on your own that you can uh, think of some nice uh, ways that you can, um, you know, enhance your business. Even if you don't have, like I was telling you guys before, don't get discouraged if you don't have gift baskets because you can use gift boxes. If you can go to uh, the stores and just get plain boxes and decorate them up really pretty, get you some really pretty gift wrap paper, you can wrap them up very pretty. In them, um, as I was saying before, you don't really need baskets to make a basket. You can use gift boxes. You can use flower pots. Um, you can use flat tray concepts. The sky is the limit. You can use just about anything to make a basket with containers. I got different ones, so many different concepts over here that I'm showing you guys. Like I said, this is a smaller gift concept which I got the cute box from Dollar General. You can decorate it up really pretty and use one of those. Or like I said, if you can't get to Dollar General, try your stores, your local stores. They may have um, nice, uh, well-used baskets. Well, not well-used baskets, but what, nice, well-used uh, gift boxes that you can use and you can just decorate them up very pretty and uh, put your you know, paper, your gift paper and gift tissue and stuff inside of it and build a, a basket out of those. You can use regular boxes so if you can't get to the store um, <clears throat> check out Wegmans or even a library you can check them out for like the newspaper stuff like that if you need newspaper or um, even Wegmans sometimes too have like newspaper out and you can take a few of those and 
use those to you know make fillers for stuffing in the uh, bottom of your baskets. Um, like I said before, you could use containers. Um, I use plastic containers. It's just different ways that you can use. I'm showing you different concepts. This is another concept here. I got a whole bunch of these white containers from um, Hobby Lobby. Um, and what I'm doing now is just taking them and making cute little gifts with them. So that's another cute little gift there. It's like a little home gift for in the kitchen that they can use. But it's just a thinking of you gift that you can give somebody. That one is a spa gift, but I'm making it as a thinking of you gift. And that's another one that I did up. I revamped it out. So what I've been doing lately is revamping out a lot of things. Like I said, I haven't been to the store to buy more inventory. I uh, wind up waking up this morning and cleaning out my storage closet back here. It looks very more cleaner and neater inside of there, which it wasn't bad before. I just had to put everything back where it was in order and stuff like that. But yeah, just use what you have. Utilize what you have. If you don't have a lot, don't get discouraged. Use what you have until you're able to get... Um, to get more inventory, things like that. That's what I've been doing. Um, and sometimes, too, when your baskets don't sell, don't get discouraged about that. Just go and um, revamp them out. What I did is I revamped this one out. This one was in the flower pot. I took it out the flower pot last night, and I wind up revamping it out. And, yeah, that's the front of the basket. That's the back of the basket there. I put a cute facial mask, a nice cute journal. This is called a cheer-me-up basket. I put a facial mask. A nice body sponge, some um, shampoo, and another body wash that they can use. This one is a cute one here. I took it out of um, the silver pan that it was in, silver container, and I placed it in this blue toy coist one. So this is one, two. Like I said, you can get the little small little baskets to start you off with and do. So those are three different concepts that I showed you guys on here um, that you can use. And things like that. Like I said, don't get discouraged if you can't, if you don't have a lot of inventory. Like I said, I um, this morning I was able to go in and clean up my storage closet in here. And I was able to find a lot of inventory. I thought I didn't really have that much, but I was able to find quite a few. I just got to go back out and get more body scrubs, um, body lotion, body creams. But I found like a lot of more empty containers, those flat uh, charger plates. I found a lot of those. I found a lot of clear glasses, just a whole bunch of nice things that I found. I'm like, oh my God, I've been, <laughs> keep going to the store buying more stuff. And when I'm looking in here, I had everything right there. So what I did is just took everything out the bins, put it neatly in there. And now everything is stacked neatly where I'm able to go in now. And if I have to use a charger, I found a whole bunch of chargers that I bought from um, Hobby Lobby a while back. Um, I bought some in silver, some in black, different colors. You can use those as flat tray concepts, um, the unbasket ones, and things like that. Yeah, so like I said, the sky is the limit. Don't get discouraged, you guys. Try to utilize what you have. If you don't have a lot, don't don't get discouraged about it. That's the same with me. Um, like I said, I got up early this morning um, and just got in here and cleaned that closet out, and it looks so much better inside of there. It was looking good before, but I was able to, now I'm able to really see everything that I have in there and I was able to find like a lot of tape, a lot of glue dots, staples, just different things that I was kept going back to the store getting already had here. So um yeah, so that's what I've been doing, just utilizing what, what I have. And like I said, um what I'm doing now is revamping out a lot of things that I have. So a lot of stuff that I have now I'm just revamping it out. Like a couple of baskets I had left from Mother's Day, I revamped those out. I had about two left from Father's Day. I revamped those and I made a Father's Day big gift basket and then I wind up um hold on you guys I'm gonna show you also too I had um revamped out one of my cup mugs so it'll be four concepts hold on for one second but you guys I'm back on so this is another one that I did up yesterday those blue flowers that I wind up getting from the Dollar Tree I did up a, a hot chocolate cup mug so we got three hot chocolates in there three different hot chocolates and I put a little cute of those embellishment of those cute flowers that I showed you guys that I got for 25 cents. I wind up taking those and placing those right in the middle of the cup. This was um, for Father's Day. This was another cup that I had did up for uh, Father's Day that I did for the men. But I wind up taking that stuff out of there and I wind up using this as a hot chocolate uh, concept here. So this is a blue and I took the little blue accessory and put in the front of here the embellishments. 
and put it in the front of there. And then there's three uh, different hot chocolates in there. Got hazelnut, mint, and a chocolate kind. So three of those in there, and I put the cute little flowers. So this is a nice cute one here that I did up. So these are different concepts. Like I said, if you can't use boxes, use cups. I got so many cups inside of here. I'm about to start using up my cup mugs that I have. We know that um, the holidays are coming up and uh, people are going to gonna be wanting hot chocolate and different things like that. I'm going to be making up some nice, cute ones with the little hot chocolates in them and the little footsies because it's about to start getting cold. So this one would be perfect too because yesterday was very cold outside and we know that we're in September now, October, November. It's cold, and then December coming up, we're going to be getting back into Christmas, so it's definitely going to be cold. So we're definitely going to need to, um, you know, need some nice uh, gifts out here, inexpensive gifts that people will buy. So this one here, next one I do up, I'm going to put the little footsies in there. i got to go to the dollar store and get some more footsies that I could be able to put inside of here along with the hot chocolates. And then I just put, took a little embellishments of flowers that I got and placed in here and this is a cute one here so that's another concept so instead of three concepts we're going to go with four concepts because you can use a cup you can use gift boxes you can use plain boxes um yeah you can use uh flower pots like i said before uh flat concept trays um even those small containers i was using those to make up the little blow pops that i make those are good so the sky is the limit don't limit yourself on what you can and cannot do and um, as I was saying before don't get discouraged about the inventory God will provide for you like I said I got up early this morning Melody says hello everyone yeah I got up, up early this morning and um, I didn't attend church today but I got up early this morning and I had went in here and cleaned um, that closet out and I wind up finding some nice cute uh, even gift wrap paper. I thought I had ran out of gift wrap paper. I went in there and I found. Excuse me. No, you can't have those. I got four adults. Those halls. Can't have them. Let me say hi. I went in there. Yeah. Okay. I'm not with you guys. Can you put some in the room so we could cage them up? Mm -hmm. Yeah, those. Yeah, those are halls. Yep, so I um yeah, I wind up going in there and I found some really nice uh gift wrap paper. So I wind up finding this one here, the silver paper. Hold on you guys. I thought I didn't have any more um paper uh, clear paper, clear cello wrap, so I wind up finding this one and these were ninety seven cents when I got these at Christmas tree shop, which they're closed now. So I went in there, I found that one there, a gold one. So I got some nice ones that I can use to do up baskets and um, just make up like fruit baskets and make up my blow pops and stuff like that. I found some nice ones. I found two of those in there. I found that burgundy one and I found that one. I found like six of them. Yeah, six of them inside of there. So yeah, so I, um, yeah, that's what I've been doing just in here uh, cleaning up this morning. Um, yeah, clean the storage out in here. It looks so much better. It looks more neater in there. Now I'm able to go in and look for the things I need. I thought I had needed more chargers. I found nice plate chargers that I got a while back from Hobby Lobby. Even ribbon. I thought I had needed more ribbon. I'm looking in here. I found probably about five or six rolls of ribbon. I got to get more ribbon, but I thought I didn't have that much left. But when I just went in here now, it looks much better and it's, it's more cleansed and, clean, you know, more... Um, well, it was clean already. It just was like kind of disorganized a little because, you know, we was trying to search and look for things. But, yeah, it looks much better inside of there. So, yeah, so I just wanted to come out and show you guys four different concepts. Okay, so if you're liking this type of content, don't hesitate to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Uh, thank you guys for my 834 subscribers. Keep subscribing because when I get at my 1,000 subscribers, I am going to be giving out a giveaway for my 1,000 uh subscriber giveaway so keep subscribing you guys because i got something very special for the thousand subscriber giveaway okay so if you're liking this type of content don't hesitate to like comment share and subscribe okay today is happy sunday and my name is rochelle all right to the next video bye